With all the work on zero, and with all the rain we had the last time, we needed some vacation. So I picked up my girl and we drove into the mountains. Hey, you need a ride, sweetheart? Yes! Okay, jump in. <laughs> Okie doke. <laughs> We had planned to stay a few days in the van, filled up the fuel tanks and took off. First stop was Potato Ship Rock, a fairly famous spot, just a few miles northeast of San Diego. Here we are, Mount Woodson Trail Road. So what are you taking with us? I pack a shirt and maybe a jacket. I don't want to get cold. And of course we take water. Yeah, and phones to take pictures. Yes, I'm coming! So we are hiking the potato ship rock. Rock, rock not mountain. <laughs> potato ship rock hiking trail, which is actually asphalt. At the moment, I don't know, we'll see. But we saw a picture in a magazine and it looked really great. And so we're here, check it out. All together. <laughs> Don't break your neck. <laughs> Ta-da! What an exhausting hike. Couch, couch potatoes entering the potato chip rock. So, what do you expect? This sweat is all real. <laughs> At the top of the hill. But it's not potato chip rock. I guess we have to go down there and find it. Here we go. Here, let's go. sitting on potato chip rock, right? Yes. It's great. And if you see us here, just sitting in the remote nature, turn around and all these people over here. Say hello! Hello! hello. Yeah, they're all waiting, so we keep it short. Yeah. Nice hike. Nice hike. A little sweaty on the middle part. 
good view. But it's awesome now here then. Yeah, that's great. So we try one of these jump pictures as well. What a sick. Okay? I'm a little bit afraid. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Surprisingly, going down was easier than going up. <laughs> nice was, hike. This is just 20 miles out of San Diego, downtown. It's a nice drive, a nice hike. Not too big, not too small, so it's, it's exercising. But it's not that you have to plan it for whatever. For weeks and ages. bring tons of provision. So huh? We just brought a little water. Yeah, and that's enough. I think it took us 45 minutes, maybe an hour to go up, and a little less going down. So it's an easy two to three hour trip, and yeah, it's good. The view is awesome, it's really stunning. It's, I'm glad I found it in the magazine, I'm glad we went over it. Yeah. Me too. But what was your highlight? Um, that you carried the backpack? <laughs> no. Life well, can be so easy. No, standing on that potato ship thing was quite cool, yeah. Yeah. It's really beautiful. And I think it's not only the potato chip, this is okay, it's, it's great, but the scenery in between, walking oh, yeah, where yeah, the big boulders sure. were, yeah, we walked yeah, kind almost of like, like a tunnel or whatever, that yeah. was great. And, yeah, that's really pretty. And we walked, I'm glad we didn't walk so much early in the morning, so we had the sun playing around with his rocks, these big huge boulders over there. Yeah, yeah it was it was nice. And it's really loud here, so yeah, yeah it's good. But this wasn't the only point on our list. There was another highlight waiting for us. We found a nice spot for the night and left next morning for a special breakfast. Apple pie for breakfast? Yes! <laughs> so you say we drove all the way to Julian just to eat breakfast here. <laughs> so built in 1872, burnt in 1957, restored in 1978. Just choose one. Apple pies of gold. You have sliced apple pie, that's where we're here for. But if you go down with a giant slip of French from the ice cream, <laughs> that's awesome. So enjoy. Thank you. You're welcome. Yummy, 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 yummy. <laughs> Best breakfast I ever had. Oh, I feel really sick after this apple pie. I don't know why. I'm really, my stomach is aching and I'm feeling hot and cold. Don't know. I carried myself back to Beast. Rebecca was fine, but for any reason I wasn't. But after a little nap I recovered and we strolled around the beautiful town of Julian. where we park right now. That's where the cafe is. Wow, 
Wow, that's a big storm. <laughs> I really like that. Yeah. So what do you think about Julian? It's a super cute town, little town, with lots of character. It's worth to go here and, and visit. Yeah. And check it out. Only 30 years old, J.M. Hamilton. Gone, but not forgotten. We really enjoyed our little time travel to the past and had a great day in Julian. We can strongly recommend to stop over there see the history of the old gold digger times. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Please subscribe to our channel and leave a comment or a like. Thanks a lot. Aloha.